it's up on the finish line, you can't run as fast as this tractor can. So that's a 3,000, that's 3,600. And there's a 4,000. There's old Alice right there. That might be a little bit bigger than the one you had. Look at the size of that turbo diesel there, though. The state had a bunch of these. Couldn't drag. Got Firestone tires on it. Got four tires on the front. Big old white wall. Welcome back party people. Today we're at the NC State Fairgrounds attending the Gotta Be NC Festival. It's a smaller version of the State Fair that showcases some of the agricultural roots of North Carolina, among other things. So check it out. Old square body Chevrolet in it. It's a V-130. Right there now. <laughs> <laughs> that just on that. Yeah. That's gonna be a big rig, huh? I wonder if they're giving all these away. Korean style hot dog. <laughs> That's the old school right there. That's pretty cool. Saw a familiar face woman up at the BMX stunt show and he took time out to snap a photograph with me. This is Corey Burglar, BMX stunt writer. Check him out on Instagram or YouTube. Cool guy. We're having a little lunch and we're gonna go back out to this. Gotta be NC. They got a tractor pool from two to six. So we're just grabbing some lunch at the farmer's market. That's where our food came from. Oh, well, that would be.
finish line and run as fast as this tractor can. Before you know it a storm rolled in so we decided to head on home before it got worse but don't you worry we already had the next day's adventure planned so we started to head out to the Dalton recreational area to get in a little bit of camping and possibly do some trout fishing as well so enjoy yeah it's grown up around here we got pops with us again we're down here on the on Basin Creek right now we got the van up up just up on the other side of the road over there but we might actually pull down on this campsite right here trying to spot some trout it's a little bit trashy right now i see a lot of leaves and stuff going through look we got the both of the monkeys out here with us this one time Chili. i got the, um a pullover in the van you can wear yeah i don't know it's not it's clear it's clearer this time than it was last time we were in here oh there's glass all back in here too we'll figure it out this is the Mac Daddy one here though. You got like two branches. Got a branch coming from over there and a branch coming from over there. Wow, that's good. Yeah, if you had your uh, waders on, you could walk out there and fish. G Money's already got the fire pit going. Shira, Shira wood, Shira, Shira. Shira wood. Shira wood? Shira wood. Might have to put the van on some leveling blocks here soon. We decided to stick around over here because we don't know what kind of rain is for in the forecast for the night. I don't think there's any at this one. We're just collecting up some wood right now. We didn't bring that much. You got your book in your bag. Yeah, I got it on my arm. Yeah, yeah somebody's not ours. It's not ours. Be careful right here now. So, yeah, somebody come up. I wanted to camp right here. I knew we'd probably get somebody tonight. But he said the fish is down by the dam. We'll try that tomorrow. Well, I spent more time trying to get the line on it right than I did fishing. <laughs> Baby, you want a beer? Huh? You want a beer? I have a this one. You already have one? Yeah. I didn't even have a chance to get it. That's what we're looking at as far as radar. We're up in that blue circle right there. It's already sprinkling. That does not look good. None of that looks good. That or that. That's huge. So I don't know. We may have to. We might have to abort mission. We've got a course going on out here with the frogs and the birds. Now I can smell a little bit. Sira, sira. Oh, that's sira. that's a G money. Sira, sira. Yeah. Well, we didn't catch any fish today, so uh, I guess we're sitting around telling stories about catching fish. Tomorrow morning, round two. All right, party people. We're going to try to go down to the dam and uh, fish a little. Got a couple spinning reels. I don't know what we're going to do. We're going to cast out and see if we can find anything. Right, babe? Yeah. Look at the size of that tree that fell. Look at that tree. Can you see it? Yeah. 
Did you bring your binoculars with you? No. Yeah, this side. Cause that's where the water pulls up. Let me see how long it is. Turn loose. Too much, too much weight on mine. Not even float away. Yes, but here's the big monster. Have you ever seen a size monster like that right there before? I mean, that thing is huge. Huge. All right, we'll let this one go. Just got him on the lid. Right up under that bush over there. I missed this one too. But that's come out from under that tree there. A little small trout. Yeah, it's small. That's the second one I've caught from over there. It might even be the same one. Same Who knows? one, yes. Babe, watch. See where he goes, okay? All right. Holy cow. He's going right back over there where that tree is. Oh, okay. That one, you got the same one. <laughs> wow. All right. We need to go somewhere where there's some big fish. I ain't even about this little small fish. So I don't know if that's the same fish or not, but right up under that shrub, up under that rock ledge there, I caught two small trout. Fortunately, I didn't have the camera running when I threw it out there, but I got them when I was reeling it in. About the size of my thumb, it's about all big as it was. This looks like a good spot, if I can get. I wish I had brought my, my water boots right here. Oh yeah, buddy. I just need to get up here in this island. Do you see the two trout right there? Right up under the rock over here. They're sitting there floating. No luck out here so far, but man, I would have thought there would be some trout up under those rocks there. And I've been floating right through there. All right, one more cast, then we're going to go get some lunch, and we're going to try a little bit further downstream instead of upstream. All right, we're headed for round two. Just had some lunch. Round two. We're going to try. A little spot down here that we were going to park at last night. Ooh, quicksand. Quicksand. I think it goes without saying that we are not professional fisher people, but uh, needless to say, we did have a lot of fun. It was good seeing Pops out there fishing for trout with a cane pole. That's something you don't see every day. We decided to wrap things up and head back to the house. Hope you enjoyed the content. Till next time, skill up and ride, van up and go. And just remember, everybody needs a plan B. Cha-cha for now.